In today's video, I'm going to be giving you an effective route that is going to beat all coverages in Madden NFL 21. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. For those of you that have never been to my YouTube channel before, my channel is designed to help you take your Madden game to the next level. I do this through a variety of ways, but one of the ways that I do this is through posting four videos every single day here on YouTube that are designed to give you some type of tangible tip, strategy, or concept that you could use to improve your game in Mad NFL 21. And so if you're interested in that, if you're interested in getting better, if you're interested in taking your game to the next level, I want to encourage you right now to go ahead and click that subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. All right, guys, uh, wanted to do a quick video here on um, a very, very specific route that is going to help you beat man to man. Now, for those of you that haven't already signed up for the text message membership, the text message membership um, is basically a way that you can get advanced tactics in Madden 21 for completely free. All you have to do is just shoot me a personal text message, and every single week I will be sending out a text on Mondays. Um, so there's still time to, time to sign up for today's. Uh, video, but I will be sending out a video every single Monday that is designed to give you that that next level, that advanced tactic that I know you all want to get because you all want to get better in Madden 21. The route we're going to be talking about today comes to us from the PA Fork. As you can see here, uh, PA Fork looks like a very unique play from the Gun White Off Trips Pats formation. And it is a very unique play. It's a really good play. In fact, um, it comes to us, uh, again, from the New England Patriots playbook. So if you haven't already tested that playbook out, it's one of the best passing playbooks in the entire game. And we're going to be breaking down one of the best formations. But the PA Fork specifically, uh, in my opinion, does a great job. As you can see here, Devontae Adams' route. And we're just going to run this play stock and I want to break down just a couple of things that you're going to see um, and this is much much more of a max coverage killer um, literally this will kill max to max coverage and real quick I just want to run through the instant replay for you so first and foremost, I want you to see that Barquez Valdez Scantling here, you're going to see when he goes out and then he goes up, you see he completely roasts the corner uh, over the top. So if they take the safeties away on us, we're going to have a one-play touchdown uh, right over top. The next thing I want to show you is this little quick route right here. There's a window to hit this low ball right in that pocket right there. That's very, very simple to throw. And then the last route is Devontae Adams. As you see here, he's going to be running an absolutely deep, dagger of a post route and one of the things that i would recommend when you're running this play is to go ahead and click that smart route button to make it go a little bit shallower all right so now we're going to throw all of these routes against the man-to-man -man coverage and we'll show you real first and foremost Devonte adams route really gets in a tender spot okay and it is going to be important for you to kind of pay attention a little bit to you know what does work against this so we are going to show you uh, with the specific play, um, again, you can leave it deep if you want. If you just want it to go really, really deep, you can do that. Um, but you'll see here, again, just run, cancel the play action. But all we're going to do is just pass lead it up. Make sure to finish your throw after you get it out. And for whatever reason, Devontae Adams is kind of dropping it really, dropping the ball right now. But you will see he will catch it up. And this is really, really good against all coverages. You're going to see here, this is going to beat every coverage in the game. I can run through every single coverage you're going to face, and you'll find that this route will beat it. Um, the next route I wanted to show you, though, real quick, is low balling R1. Right when he cuts, just low ball, and you'll see that you're going to be able to hit that route very, very consistently. So I wanted to really quickly um, show you what this looks like if they put purple zones on the field. So if they put purple zones on the field, that's going to best defend this out route, but you see here, you're still able to low pass it still able to get the ball out to that receiver now with your tight end and your running back one of the things that i like to do with with the running back is put him on an option route with the tight end you can do a lot of different things i actually really like to put him on a block and release delay fade i love that route because he's going to sit back and pass protection and then you can actually release him if his guy blitzes and you see he's going to beat man-to-man -man coverage late in the play, um, which is oftentimes when I need it most. And then the last thing that I want to show you is what happens if they take the safeties away over the top. Well, you're going to see this little out and up. Oftentimes we'll get a ton of separation over the top. And here you see it's a one-play uh, touchdown to Marcus Valdez-Scantling. Now you can smart route that route as well. So you can smart route both Devontae Adams' route um, and 
Uh, let me show you here. So you can smart route the out and up, and you can smart route Devontae Adams. This is what they're going to look like. So you'll see here MVS going to go out, up, and then you're just going to bomb right over the top. And as you can see there, that's shaded coverage over top. He's still able to beat it. Now, I personally would not recommend uh, smart routing out and up routes. Okay, I would recommend just leaving it stock. But I would recommend smart routing Devontae Adams. So we're going to leave Marquez Valdez Scantling on that stock out and up. And you'll see here just torching. Uh, just torching man-to-man -to -man coverage over the top of the defense. So this play, this this play in general, guys, is very very effective. Um, there's not a lot of defenses that are going to be able to stop this route um, or these route combinations together. The real question is whether or not you're going to have enough time to get the ball off. Um, that's honestly the biggest question that I would have. Now, if you are facing, let's say, for example, you're facing a lot of zone with this. So if you're not facing man-to-man, -man, I would recommend for uh, Marquez Valdez scaling, I would recommend just putting him on a smart routed hitch route or a um, out route. Um, or if he's a slot apprentice, putting him on a corner route would work really, really well. But this will allow Devontae Adams' route to be able to destroy the cover four uh, over the top of the defense just by putting him on a simple smart route of the hitch route. And then cover two defense, um, Devontae Adams' route is going to just light it up. As you'll see right here, he's going to get up the seam, make that nice inside cut to the goal post. And Aaron Rodgers is going to throw an absolute dart to him over the top. So this is one of the better plays in the game. I wanted to break it down for you guys in this video. I hope this was helpful. Make sure to sign up for the text message membership. And if you haven't already, you can join our Discord. A link to joining the Discord is in the description of this video. We will be live tonight on YouTube. We stream every single night at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. So I'd love to catch you at one of our live streams tonight. Thank you so much for watching today's video. And we will see you guys tomorrow.